Alright guys, today we're back with another video. It's really early in the morning. I don't know, it's like 5.30, I don't know what time it is. But we're about to head to a yeah, show. That's not making the video. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're here in Houston, Texas. We're going to a car show this morning. We have the Pagani and the Ferrari. Trailered them all the way down here. So we'll see. We're going to see a little bit of Houston's car culture today. Some exotic cars. <sighs> Just jumped in the pool. Yeah. You don't need to stick your head in the pool. Yes. <laughs> He looks great. I'm super tired, so let's get it. guys there's a whole bunch of cars lined up around everywhere we have the Ferrari and the Pagani parked right in the middle of this cool little pavilion thing there's speakers so if you can't hear me I'm sorry but there's speakers all these cars along on each side we got a food truck for a car show that we've never been to pretty good turnout I mean we drove what four hours here five it took five because he drives slow <laughs> but we, we made it and so uh, we're gonna walk around a little bit see what kind of cars are here and uh, We'll see what they got. Let's go. So this is a 600 LT. It kind of looks like a mixture of all the cars that McLaren's putting together, the 570, the 675, and like, what? The seats. The seats? Oh, does it have the set of seats in it? No. Oh, it just has bucket seats. I like this orange, like the, it's like a plain it's like color. color. It's it Stratman orange, orange. but <laughs> I like it. This is a cool car. Yeah. It's awesome. The exhaust comes out of the roof. Is this the spit flames? It's clean, bro. This carbon fiber bumper? Pretty sick. I don't think that's stock. Is that carbon fiber bumper stock? All stock. Everything stock. All stock. It has a track pack, carbon package, the P1 seat. Oh, so you went for P1 seats instead of Senna seats? Yeah, man. I'm, I'm kind of big, man. Oh, trust me. We know the Senna seats. <laughs> So he said it had the P1 seats, uh, and he opted to go for that because they're more comfortable than the 
center seats. This carbon fiber all right there, 600 LT logo right there. Yo, I like this shit better than this one. Y'all don't like this You think so? This is, I think, compared to like 720Ys and the center and everything. I think he was just saying that he drives the 600 LT every single day. He's been driving it every day for a month straight. I mean, is, is it comfortable? Yeah. Shoot. You get used to it. It's a, just like a stiff, like a car with coil levers, pretty much. So it's a stiff car, but I'm sure it's at least a little bit comfortable to drive. You're driving every day. The doors got up, so it's got to be cool. So Mustang, Mustang, Corvette, Viper. We got some muscle cars here too. Not just exotic. There's a whole bunch of stuff. Look, there's a Land Cruiser, Bronco. There's a whole bunch of stuff over there. Cool car. There's a line of cool cars along the outside, but on the inside, it's kind of where they put the best cars. You see, there's a Rolls, G Wagon, 600 LT, uh, Huracan, Huracan. Then on the other side, it's similar car. It's kind of like a VIP. What do you think, bro? They look a little too close to the cars. I feel like they're a little bit too close. To the cars. I know it's like there's a pandemic. I thought we were doing social distancing, like, you know, like six feet, but I, I guess that's not a thing anymore. Six inches. <laughs> All right, guys, uh, you've probably seen this car before. It's my boy Sinclair Photos over here. Yes, sir. Car. You want to talk about your car a little bit? Uh, well, it's blue and it's slow. That's about all you need to know. That's all you <laughs> That's all you need to know. If I was to get one, it would probably be in this like, color. Oh, yeah. Black with the blue. I feel like it would be better if they had like blue stitching on it. The blue? Yeah, black with red. Got blue. Oh, no, I mean, look at the paddle. Oh, the paddle pictures are blue too. Uh, hey, he left his key in it. He left his key in it, so uh, let's take it for a spin. You guys like this wing, big wing gang? So if you were having to pick a car, would you pick the ZR1 Corvette or would you put Z01 Camaro? Not too bad. No, this is like a little bit older, but I don't know. In the 90s? I mean it looks cool. I guess I was in the sixties. At the in the time period, I, it must have been a cool car. This right now, it doesn't look like what I think it would, would be cool. But if you if you had to pick your Acura, would it be silver, black, yellow? Well, that's a Honda. That's like the little NSX thing that they deal with again. I, I don't know much about that, but it's pretty cool. Wow, with this thing. I don't know why that one. I don't know. Do you know why it has Honda? This is like similar to the car we were driving the other day, but this is the Phantom. Yeah. This is like, I don't know if you guys could see this. It's like a matte paint. I mean, it looks pretty cool. It's a smaller version of the DB11 that we drove. And I think it, is it, is it a V8? I don't even know the answer. I think this is a V8. I mean, it's really cool. I've actually never seen one in person like this close. I like this one, the inside better. The inside, let's see if we get a good picture of the inside. All right, it's like, it's like the same color as the car in red. Oh, so those red stripes are in there? That's pretty sick. Oh, yeah, this is smaller. Is there not a, this is not a backseat, right? No, this one, oh, so this one doesn't have a backseat. I guess the other one had a backseat, even though nobody will ever sit in the backseat. This one doesn't have one. Look how fat that tire is. That is a fat tire. It needs to lay off the Chick-fil-A. And talk about, about to go eat. <laughs> no, it's not. That's a Bentayga right there. And it, it looks like the brand new one. We got two nice Shelby Cobras right here. They look like they're like a matching set. They're almost like the same car. A few moments later. So the car show's over now. We're gonna load the cars back into the trailer. So we got the Ferrari in the classic trailer, the Pagani in uh, the trailer, other trailer that we rented. Man, we just tried to load in the trailer and there's just a crowd forming. These cars are insane, guys. So look, there's just cars pulling up out of nowhere. People are everywhere. Hey, comment below, comment below. Which, do, which one do you like? Which is your favorite, the, the La Ferrari or the Pagani? I mean, I'd, I'd take the Pagani in my opinion. So, but Gage would, Gage would say otherwise. <laughs> Thank you.
remember this, remember this ramp, be careful. Sipping with my sneaky link. <laughs> Look at your ugly. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 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 it's a very nice. It's a very nice. Watch out for that. Bro, you just hit the car. Oh my. What do you got to say to Riley's fans? They're cool. That's it. <laughs> All right, how's getting out the, the window? <laughs> Not easy. <laughs> I have some hip flexibility. I ran track.